Okay, guys, so, uh, from the title, you already know what I'm going to do, but I'm going to explain why. So, here's the main reason. So, if I have, like, a room right here, okay, and then we have another room up here, alright? So, if we have a basic level like this, and we just put the player right here, and since all of the enemies will just make a beeline for that player, if, like, we have some enemies scattered around here, they're all gonna end up way out of place than where I would want them, and probably all against a wall or leaking out into here. We don't want that, so <laughs> I'm gonna remake the whole game into 3D. Because I don't like myself. I need to explain this more, but basically Unity 2D doesn't support pathfinding, and Unity 3D does. If you don't know what pathfinding is, um, so uh, if we have like a square here, then we have the player here. Um, the enemy, the enemy will know what the player's location and obstacles, so it'll go, so it'll avoid this and go around to the player instead of just making a straight beeline and running into the wall. So that's why I'm going to remake the game in 3D. So I booted up Unity and hit that create button. Well, now that this new Unity project is open, uh, we'd better get to work designing a player and stuff. So I added a little platform to test things out on, and then I added BEAN! Now we just wait for Visual Studio to load, and if you don't know, it takes literally forever. Eventually. Okay, guys. So uh, I got the, I, after a while, I got the bean moving around. So um, yeah. Uh, well, the bean the bean works. If it, like we can look, I wanted it to be like Doom. I wanted it to be like the original Doom. So um, if this loads. So, yeah, so there's no looking up, but you can look in any direct. There's no looking up, but any other direction is fine. You can move around, and because the original Doom was two-dimensional, there's no gravity. Which is totally not an excuse, but, uh, you know, we got it working. And then, because I couldn't afford the prototype materials on the Unity Asset Store, I just rec I just poorly recreated them in GIMP. Okay, guys, so I drew this little stick man as a placeholder, and he's now in the game. So, um, he's a, he's a sprite. <laughs> Just like the original Doom, because that's what they use. They use sprites, and I don't know what the <clears throat> I don't know what the world was made out of, but uh, yeah. So now I just gotta have them rotating towards me at all times, because I just figured they would, but I guess they don't. All right, guys. So uh, I, I got it working. Um, so Henry here, he'll now face he'll now face the player. What? He'll now face the player at all times. So um, it's like the original Doom. It's like the original Doom. So if I go over here, he'll, you'll, you'll notice that he, he always faces the player, and I gave him a box collider so I can't walk through him. Yay. The next thing I did was I added the dashing ability to my game. This is still very hard to do with one hand, but also added this cube, because cube. But uh, if you hold down shift, because it's usually shift in FPS games, uh, if you hold down shift, you go, like, see if right now you're going to 12, your speed is 12, but if you hold down shift, it goes up to 24 and you move twice as fast, just like in the original game. So the next thing I wanted to work on is shooting, because this is a shooter game, so let's get going. Okay guys, so uh, I drew up a ketchup, I drew up a ketchup gun, I think. And uh, we're gonna get into the game now. Okay, guys. So I got the shooting working. It totally took me three minutes and not three days. But um, anywho, uh, y you can shoot. You can. There's this little placeholder that I have over there called Sticky Stick. If you shoot him, he explodes and boom, it works. I drew a tearing up, and we're gonna get him animated and chasing the player now, just like in the original game. I was working on my game, and then the game Bracky's Game Jam theme boy opened up, so uh, we're gonna vote on the theme. Um, I, I like Alone Together, where I'm gonna vote for that. Hey guys, so um, I need to get the tearing up animated, but other than that, I fixed him up. So uh, he is very, very fast, and you know the game over screen is the same thing as the last one; it just deletes the player. So I haven't added one yet, but um, yeah. So yeah, and then I haven't, and then I'm gonna wall this off later. But uh, I don't know why I didn't do this earlier. And then you can just boom, 
Gonna get him animated now. Guys, so I drew up a real, I drew up a, a catch of 47, and now we gotta get this into the game. So anyway, it's Sunday, so you know what that means. I had to take a break from making games and have a Super Bowl party all by myself. I hosted the party, and honestly, I just came for the food. So the next thing I did, I could have, I worked on a huge new feature. This is gonna change the whole game. You might think, you might think that I worked on the core gameplay, but you're wrong. All I did was made it so that when you shoot the gun thing, you get some recoil. I just think it looks nice. Well, uh, since we have the basic gameplay down, I, uh, I guess it's time to get working on the first level. All right, guys, so I made the first level. It's like a lab and I made it out of, just kidding. Yeah, I made this huge thing. We got some trees, a road, some parking spaces, a car for the player. You can't drive it, but. Then we have my favorite restaurant, which is with Bon Apps. It's with Bon Apps. I can say that. So I made this really quick, quick area, the first 3D model of the whole game, which is a deck. Wait a minute! Which is, which is a, um, a desk, I think. <laughs> it's so bad, I can't even tell. But, um, and then, um, I made this guy who's gonna be the worker here, and I'm not gonna spoil the story for now, but, uh, he, basically he's screaming. And now I have this little scene set up. If you walk into the door, uh, you, you come here, and then, um, there's this little desk, a worker, and then it says yesterday's menu. You got a freckled burger, a France fried, and some chicken nuggets. It's, it's delicious. Okay, guys, so, um... Uh, this this is hard. This is um so um I don't want to spoil the I don't want to spoil the game for you guys, but uh, this isn't gonna have a really heavy story, but it's gonna have like a light one, kind of like Mario, but it's not like the story's not like Mario at all. But um anyway, so if we go into the door, all right, guys, and that's all I have time for today. Uh, the Brackies game jam is coming up soon, and I need to get all this edited, and we're gonna have a fam, and we're I'm gonna go see my family tomorrow. So uh, I need to get this edited together. And while I'm at it, I'm just going to order a freckled burger. So see you guys next time.